Well, I'm back after a bit of a break, so yeah, let's get right into this video. But first of all, the video that I'm doing is a book review where I'm going to be showing you some of the books that. This thing's going on me. Some things that. Some. Uh, some books that I really like. Some of them I read a while ago, some of them I'm still reading, and some of them I've read recently. So yeah, let's get on with the video. I'm going to start off with like the newer books that I've only just read and one of them I'm like halfway through reading. It's like amazing. The Maddie Ziegler, it's called The Maddie Diaries and it's the diary of Maddie Ziegler pretty much. It's just amazing and I really like it. I'm up, <laughs> like, see I'm still reading it. It's got like heaps of photos. So a few of the photos. And then it's like telling us about a lot of stuff and like so there's like what she writes and then there's stuff that people write about her like family friends and all that or just her friends and then there's also when people write to Maddie and it's like Dear Maddie pages. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I really like this book and I'll be reading it over and over and over I'm pretty sure. Next, now, I'm really obsessed with the Titanic, I don't know why, I've been on a few cruises myself so I should probably not like it because like, it's crucial that when it's an iceberg, but I like it, I think it's pretty cool, and I got this book called Titanic Young Survivors, I've already read it and it's just awesome, it just like shows the views of three different people, yeah. So there's 17 year old Jack Thayer, or Thayer, I didn't know how to say that, 15 year old Edith Brown, and then there's 11 year old Billy Carter, and um, yeah, I haven't read it in a, like I read it a couple of weeks ago, but it's really good, so yeah. Now there's these books that are like, they're not classics, they're just really good books that I haven't read, it's not since like last year and all that. So yeah, there's this one called Spoil It Rod and it's only a little book. But I used to be part of this like magazine club thing called Go It. And I got it from it and I got a lot of these books from that one. And it's about a girl and she every year she goes on a camping trip with her dad and um her mum dies or something. And then like her dad gets a new girlfriend and then his daughter comes on the camping trip and she thinks she's gonna ruin it and the daughter not like the girl that's writing this the daughter of the dad's girlfriend is really spoiled and yeah and then there's this one which is another girl there it's called river boy and i actually dressed up as the person from this one yeah the book, the book week i think it's called when i was in primary school and yeah it's about like she moved away and she meets this boy by the river and yeah and then he reveals his secret which is pretty exciting you should get read this book <laughs> next i got this one from my school it was like a thing that came in a pack for a workshop that i did before i went to that school and it's called The Many Worlds of Albie Bright and it's really cool. It's about this boy called Albie and um, and his parents are scientists and his dad, like, it's about physics and parallel universes. So yeah, and he travels using a rotting banana in a box. It's cool. I liked it. Um, when I, when I first read it, I'm like, I'm gonna like this, it's boring. But I kept on reading it and it was really good. Um, next is See If I Care. It's another girl yet. Um, this one wasn't girl yet, this one was from school. This one's another girl yet. It's called See If I Care and it's about a girl that's like pen pal sort of thing and she writes to a boy. And, yeah. And they both have a couple of secrets or the lies that they tell in it. Like, they write, they don't completely say the truth when they write because their families aren't the best. Like, they're not like normal. Because they think that they're not like normal. But. 
Um, our next, the next, <laughs> some type. The next one is Emmy, which is about a girl called Emmy, obviously. I think she lives in Canada or somewhere. But it's like, it's a bit like a diary. I'll show you the inside. But it's not like that. It's just, but all over the back there's all her writing and that's her there. And so the last book is Water Balloon and it's about a girl called Marley and she really likes dogs and yeah, her, it's pretty much just like another one about people's lives kind of get flopped upside down. Like her parents are divorced and her best friends are like not really her best friends anymore. And but there's a cute boy down the road that likes dogs as well, so yeah. Now that's all the books that I'm showing you today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye!